to show you so um, yeah we'll get into it and uh, tell you a bit about them and then uh, we're going to do some builds and show you how they perform so uh, we've kindly got all of this from Fibre Freaks at Vape Jam UK so um, yeah big thumbs up for that guys thank you very very much and like Lewis said it's a new wicking material that um, we got introduced to whilst we were there um, they've got two types really the original stuff it's um, what what is it made out of again? It's cellulose. It's, yeah, so cellulose. yeah, it's um, it's not a, a cotton. It's a cellulose fibre. It's and, really um, good for high temperatures. Oh, it really, and it's and really high strong. Wattage. So um, it, it is. It's very strong as well. It really it coils nice and easy. But yeah, um, and then they do the other one, which is the cotton blend, and that's like a bit of both. So you get a nice organic cotton. It's more, it's more what you'd be used to really, isn't it? So yeah, yeah like Lewis said, it's a bit of both. Throwing in a bit of this stuff in with, uh, mixed it in so that's uh, added to it and made it all better. So, um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's really good stuff to be fair. We it were, is uh, really impressive. It, it, it feels a bit weird, doesn't it? I mean, it really this, does feel weird. This original in the stuff, yeah. yeah it's, uh, and, uh, it does feel a bit artificial. Almost. It does a little bit, yeah. I mean, um, obviously, yeah. So. So but it is really, really nice. It's really absorbent, um, and like we said with this, the original stuff, it's really good for the high temperatures as well. Yeah. So uh, and we've been we've been using this since we come back from Bay Jam. It's been been about two weeks now. So we've used used both types yeah. in, in loads of different builds as well. I mean, they've kind they've kind of given us all of their range. So I mean, we've got the ones Everything. that you normally use for if you're a bit of a lazy builder ones that are for intermediates, your, your advanced users, yeah, I mean, they've you've got, got these grade ones, one, yeah. grade twos, so grade ones for your tank, uh, for your drippers, grade twos for your tanks. These are, you get 20 wicks that are all pre-cut in a two and a half mil thickness to just pop straight through the coils for beginners and stuff. So. They're really, really good for the beginner side of things. Yeah. And then you've got um, the pads there, uh, and then the bigger pads and strips from the uh, the number ones for the drippers. So yeah. Um, so I think that's about all. I mean, we can't really find many places selling this at the moment. There is there's a couple of places out there. You've got www.greyhaze.co.uk. I'll put a link there for you as well. Obviously, Fibre Freaks can go onto their website and they'll give you distributors as well. So that's www.fiberfreaks.com. Got another link there for you. My arm's getting. We've <laughs> <laughs> yeah, got vampirevapes.co.uk as well. So I'll we'll also put a link down there for you. Uh, yeah, that's it for the links. Um, prices in that, it's, it's, it varies yeah, a bit as it well. It does. I mean, the smaller packets seem to be about three ninety nine ish, three fifty, but. Um, yeah, I mean, bigger packets can't really find anywhere either. No. I, mean, I, I would go on around about the sort of five ninety nine price. To yeah, be probably. With you. They've got to be around the same yeah. sort of price as the leading. Everyone, everyone else, all the bigger packets and that. Yeah, all the leading competitors with the big brands and stuff. They're all like yeah. five ninety nine, six ninety nine for a big yeah, pack yeah. of cotton. So, but yeah, that's about it. I mean, should we open some of these and just show them quickly? Or? Yeah, 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 definitely. So, um, I mean, yeah. Uh, in the XL packets, the strips. And this is the cotton blend. So you get a really nice big long strip. You can definitely tell it's a cotton blend. You get them unique little bits of bark and things that you got to pick out on that. But uh, yeah, I mean it's it's a really nice cotton. It is nice. You get blend. a really nice flavour from it. Well, to be honest with you, you like. It, when, when you're juicing up on different uh, juices, you usually get a lot of that discolour that comes to your, your wicks after 
a few vapes and you don't really get any discolouring of this stuff, do you? It's no, really, really good. Cool. It's really good. It's, for it's that. got good tolerance and to it. And this is the Cellulose original blend. You can see it's crystal white. It's ever so fluffy. It's almost like feels shiny. That sort of feel. But yeah, it's it's. it's like it, it, does, it, it feels very artificial, but it is really nice stuff. It is. It's so strong as well. Uh, let's show you some of the pads. Yeah, so have a look at some of the pads. Get the These are the big pads. Size, it's just yeah, it's just the uh, packet. Uh, it's the best so, time we've opened these little packs, so uh, yeah. you get a nice Standard little like cotton and that where you can sort of cut it up to the size of width that you want and uh, the thickness that you want. I mean, we personally prefer the strips, we always tend to see be able to the same diameter in the diameter. When, so, uh, when we've uh, been using these, we've um, got down to using half of it for two wicks so yeah, yeah. we yeah. get a double what we need out of the strip yeah. so it's pr we're pretty good stuff good. really but I mean shall we uh, wick so, up? Yeah let's um, I've got a few builds to wick up so I'm sure. going to do a couple of wicks you're going to do so yeah. we're going to show you how they perform. Got a nice new fresh build for you guys on my dot mod so that's a new V2 Got a uh, 24 gauge night chrome build on there. It's just running at 0.56 ohms, so nice and safe for the cross box. 16 wraps, I think, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, 16 wraps. Yeah, 16 wraps yeah. that you went for. So, we were in a sort of trial phase, so I went for 18 and you went for 16. Well, we ended up at 16, but yeah. We're getting there with it. So, uh, I'm going to go straight in with the original. Um, the original as well, didn't you? Well, I was just trying to think, uh, let's see, yeah, just do a bit of the old art attack effect here, if you guys remember this. This is one I've done earlier. A bit closer on that for you. Um, this is the original blend in here. Yeah. Okay, so we'll probably fast forward all this bit so you don't have to sit here and watch us do all of this. But. Highs and lows yeah, with no explanation that makes sense. Do we all go wayward and not even know? Have we really come such a long way? I think not. Like animals in a cage, we are all trapped in our own way. And today, it's so hard to escape. Honey, 
And it's dark, honey. And it's clear, honey. Funky, honey. And it's golden, honey. And it's dark, honey. And it's clear, honey. Funky, honey. And it's golden, honey. And it's dark, honey. And it's clear, honey. And organic, honey. Funky, honey. Funky, honey. Funky, honey. Funky, honey. seen us uh, do it all so in the blue box I got the original in the red box I got the cotton blend and I'm just gonna say it right now this is possibly one of the nicest cottons and cellulose fibers that I've ever used it's so easy to use comes a nice easy part goes through the coil really nice it's just a pleasure to work with it really is it really is hands down definitely oh, yeah. I'm gonna vouch for that as well we've had some noise where we've stuff. just struggled with getting the wick to do what we want it to do and yeah this stuff is just a joy to work with so yeah what one are you gonna um, crack on first with then um, I'm gonna go on go to the original yeah yeah go to the original first all right I'll go to the original as well one more then I've just dripped up with some of this stuff, wick liquor, yeah, uh, uh, Contra, so yeah, we'll be doing a review on that soon. What you, what yeah, you dripped up on? I dripped off on some of the... Uh... Some of the old uh, Charlie's chalk dust, Wonder Worm, and uh, yeah, it's really good this stuff, so um, we'll be doing a review on that as well. Right. And yeah, let's show you some clouds on the... Uh, the original cellulose spider. Yeah, instantly. First hit of that wick. No wick taste, no weird taste, it's just good. pure flavour from the juice. It is really good stuff. That is amazing. It's it is. The, fact, the thing I like about it is obviously how absorbent it is. It's really good stuff. And obviously where we run on the unregulated boxes as well, they're always running at a high temperature and a high wattage, so it's really, really good stuff. I'm taking a full long hit, I'm not getting no burnt taste. You can see how many times I'm going on this. Literally taking all my lungs and it, no burnt taste, nothing. Some really good. I'm not even pulsing, I'm going full whack my shirt. <laughs> Battery might be getting a tap low, maybe, that might be more of it. Well, that was uh, seven pulls and it's still going well. I've lost count, I reckon I'm on about seven, eight. And these are fresh batteries as well. Still going strong. They look relatively dry, but I'm still not getting any kind of dry hit. I'm going to have a couple more goes. Yeah, mine are getting a bit dry as well. So a couple more bangs. Still no burn. Yeah, 
get what I mean. I'm still not getting no Bernie taste. No I'm, Bernie taste at all. I'm gonna leave it Nothing. there, but um, yeah, I think we need to uh, cut it there in a minute because we've uh, taped out the room. Just boxed it out so, a bit. Uh, so I'll be back in a minute. Boop, we're back. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so uh, yeah, we'll crack on to the next one, the cotton blend. So uh, yeah, I've done this in this one. I've got a couple in this one. Mm. I went for the whip liquor. We will be doing a review of that one soon. I'm gonna drip up in some of this quickly. I already dripped up in the end. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, so again on, on this this cotton blend, if you're really into your cottons this is going to be right up your street because uh, yeah until that stuff i was banging to my cottons but it's still very it's good it's really good this is the coded big foot we're going to be doing this soon as well but yeah let's see what this stuff's about oh the flavor instant it's just mint so flavor. impressive. It's really, really good stuff. Yeah. I mean, from other cottons, I would get, for the first couple of drips, you get a weird sort of flavor from the, the new flavor. Yeah, you, you, sort of. I don't but know, it's, it's quite hard to explain, isn't it? Definitely from but cotton bacon. I always used to get on the first couple of drips, a funny taste, yeah. and then it would wear away. But this, straight out the back, beautiful flavor. I mean, I was pulsing it because I don't trust cotton on full power on these boxes, but um, yeah, it's, uh, from me, I would say that's amazing, really, and you should see the cloud production. It is really nice again, stuff, and, uh, I mean, I think it's more of like an artificial taste that you get from certain other yeah, cottons. Yeah, especially and, uh, cotton bacon. I mean, stuff I'm not putting up against cotton bacon, I really do like cotton bacon, but it's not, this stuff for me is blown out of the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do like this stuff. It is good. It's just a few little bits that you got to pick out, but that's about it, really. So uh, I mean, you should be doing that with your cotton anyway, just you know, making sure there's no contaminants in there because they, they do sneak through. Uh, it's, it's pretty. To be fair, it's ultra clean for what I've seen on cotton. And, uh, yeah, it's just really impressed with this whole range that you can get from them as well. I mean, yeah. obviously, yeah, they really, really are offering you a complete entire range of looking materials here. Yeah, I mean, from tanks to beginners, from intermediates to even your advanced users using your original, they still do them a number two, which is for your tank. So, we haven't personally tried the tank one now yet. We will be no, doing that and maybe come back and do maybe a little review on that one. Well, you've got your RTA and I'm still waiting for my RTA to turn up. So, well, yeah, we'll give them a go over the next few weeks. And we'll see what they're like. But yeah, we, we did, we sat there for a good half an hour with the guys from Fiber Freaks going did, through yeah. everything about it with them. And it's really good stuff. So, but we just want to find out what the density is like between the two different types as well. Yeah. So, I mean, we'll get round to that eventually. Yeah, it does seem this stuff you can definitely go a higher temperature, I would say, because I can just go full whack on my frost box, which is a, a Dual 18 650 series running about a 0.5 ohm coil so um, for the same build with a cotton blend I have to pulse it because otherwise you will get that burnt taste from the coils heating up so hot. It will be um, impressive to see what this is like in your quad. Yeah, yeah definitely. So I think that will be I, the I right think, sort of I think, stuff for it. I think it's already in my quad. Wait a minute. What have we got here? <laughs> my quad. <laughs> <laughs> Which I happen to already put some Fiber Freaks original grade one dripping fiber in there. So um, let's have a little drip up and kill each other on the quad. Oh, let's do it quickly. And uh, I have got my mech here as well, so we can have a go on the mech. I've got some more juice here, Pancake Man, another one that we'll be doing a, a review of later on. Uh, yeah. Let's get into it, so let's, let's see what it's like. Should we do yeah. some pancake, mate? Yeah, 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 we might as well try and put some pancake, mate. 
another little cheeky purchase that we got from Pager. This is an absolute beast. Lewis with his party tricks. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a treble. I haven't got it down here today, but um, you've probably seen it on a few other videos if you haven't. Look for our other videos. We've got all sorts. Indeed, indeed. But, uh, yeah, this. If I can get it open, I don't see if we can get it open. It's a beast to get open. But yeah, look at that. That's all series, full 18650 quad. They're not fully charged, but they're still kicking out some voltage there. And uh, <laughs> wow, let's kill each other. Let's throw them pancakes, mate. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. Have to pulse this beast. <laughs> I'm taming it. <laughs> don't, it, don't expect that from me. <laughs> yeah, that's a beast. That is a beast. And uh, my beautiful old mod with uh, a polished flat wire night chrome build in it. I don't think you can see it from that distance. She's a beauty. I think this is about 0.13 ish. And, uh, <coughs> that was a big part. All, yeah. all, all we've got here is running on this stuff. Ooh. And uh, yeah, we love it. It works in all different boxes and mods and voltages and resistances, ohms. Now that wicking material is the right one for this box, definitely. So if you're into your crazy box builds and stuff like that, then this stuff is right up your street as well, guys, because high temperature, boy, does this kick. <coughs> yeah, man, definitely. But so, yeah, I mean... Well, quick recap. Like yeah. we said, we have struggled to find where you can get this from. I suppose, really, we need to get back in contact with Fiber Freaks and find out for you more, so we will do yeah. that. Yeah, I mean, there but, are a few places, <coughs> but a lot of them seem to be out of stock, so maybe it's just waiting until the end of the month till they restock. Yeah. We'll put all the links uh, down below for you. Like we said, we'll make sure we do that. It is quite high in demand, this stuff, so it seems to go off the shelf quite quickly. There's a reason for that. It's very good, and um, hopefully this review shows you just how good we think it is. Um, yeah, I mean, there's not really much much more else to say about it. I mean, we've left a few details out about the actual cotton itself, but we'll put that in the end. Um, yeah, we will. There's a lot to put in there about this stuff, so we'll put that in the description for you guys. Yeah. So, but yeah, no, well, thanks for watching. Yeah. And if you like our videos, don't forget to subscribe. We'll put a link down there for our Facebook group as well, just in case. And um, keep your eyes for the next review as well. Yeah, it's about that's it, really. Yeah, that's it. So, cheers. Peace, Peace out, guys. Out. See you later.